back out at site three been a while and um hunting for tracks water source is really low now dog days dry hot it's here trails from here way down yonder to the, the primary creek that runs the whole length of this this valley. Now, I'm hunting next to the water source because I'm figuring this is where it'd be at. So, this is what I'm doing. I'm on the hunt. I'm hunting now. I'm not just exploring. So, when I find something of any significance, I'll be sure to take a picture, take a video, and I'll let you guys know. Hey, everybody. Found a little something. Right about the same place I found that worn knuckle track. It's not quite as big as that 18-inch track I found. Here we go. 16 inches. Toe to hill. Stepped right there. Headed out that way. You can see right in here where that break is, the mid tarsal break. Now, side to side, eight inches. So that's about right. That's about right. Hey, as I said, it's not the 18 inch track that I found, but that's no little one. All right, guys. Off we go. All right, guys. Hey, the reason why I come up here to site three is because, well, First of all, this is where I found that massive knuckle track. Um, got that footprint right there. I, I, I'm, I'm just getting lucky. Guys, I'm getting real freaking lucky. As I'm seeing where they're, I don't know if you can tell this or not, but right around in here, looks like they're you know, digging up, digging around, looking for grubs and whatnot, like a bear would. Um, right about in here, you bastard, right about in here is where I found the, uh, knuckle track. Of course, it's gone now. It's been a while and had a lot of rain. I don't know if you can tell it or not. Ground's been dug up a little bit here. I couldn't really tell what the hell it was that was doing it. You really can't tell. And the grounds, the leaves are disturbed. It could have been anything. You know, if it's bear, deer, squirrel. I've seen squirrels make a mess like this too. You know, looking for nuts and whatnot. But couldn't really, couldn't really tell for sure. Like it's. You know, I'm I'm not a master tracker. I can hold my own enough to where I can find my way out of a place or to wherever it is I'm I'm looking for. But this is the obvious direction to travel. The ground's been tore up. Went back up in there. Yeah, got a hemlock right there. Right around that in between it, let's see, yeah, right about in there where that hemlock is on either side, it's all tore up right around in there. There's impressions there, but it's just not enough to give you a definitive look. See, um, there are a couple big ones in there, but it could be tromped on a couple of times, so I, I'm just gonna leave it be. 
for now. I'm going to cross right here for a couple of minutes and then I got to head back. I got work to do. We'll see. Well, it's nice and cold right here. Cool breeze blowing through the trees. Cool breeze. I'm about to run out of battery. Huh. I was at seventy five percent when I started. So here we go. A lot of deadfall, right? All that brush piled up in there. You know, brush piles, you usually not think a whole lot of it. You know, it's just natural, but this, you know, learning a little bit from people who have actually been into, into this a hell of a lot longer than me, I turn my way of thinking around. As I mentioned in the previous video, mundane sign. It's just, why would anybody do this? Why, would, why do they do this? All right. Evidence of burnt pieces of wood up in here, too. I don't know if you can tell that or not. That's what that is. It's not just old. It's burnt. Right? I mean, if there's a forest fire in here, you'd be able to tell it. I've been in a forest that's been hit by fire pretty bad. And uh, even to this day, you can still tell it in some places. It's a scar, you know? It takes a long time to heal. But, um, yeah. And this, folks, is another thing. See this tree, the way it's broke over I was busted a long time I think you know that's just natural time gravity age you know no I don't think so I think this was this was busted I don't think it was green when it was busted I think it would have split. It would have been rough. Well, what do I know? I don't. I don't know nothing, really. You know what I know, and hell, probably right now, you probably know more than what I know. I don't know. <laughs> I don't know. So here, <laughs> hey, I'm just tromping through the woods, trying to find sign of old squatch the hairy man but I'm pretty sure he's not the only one traipsing around in these woods now well Wish I could stay out here a lot longer, but time dictates that uh, I have to go back to man's world and st start doing stuff that people do. See that little guy? It's loud. Oh, bugger. 
You gonna follow me around? Probably follow me about halfway to the truck. That wouldn't surprise me. All right, guys. I'm gonna go ahead and sign off now and try and get back to the human world and put up with that BS. I'd stay here longer if I could. I'd bring my family out here and we live off the land. But <sighs> Lord have mercy. Guys, next time, y'all take care of yourself. Um, be happy. Enjoy life. Take time out for the little things. It's uh, it's good that you do that because we don't have a whole lot of time on this world. And uh, I'm going to try and enjoy every bit of it as I can. So you guys, uh, like I said, y'all got you guys take care of yourself. Love you, mean it. <laughs>